Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. Do you suffer from pipe hammer? And are you looking for a simple and easy way to solve this problem yourself? If so, then you've come to the right place. Now, in this very bathroom, previously I showed you how you could install a springed anti-hammer tap washer to solve this problem. Well, it's been about six months now and had a fair few comments from people saying how it was a fairly short term solution to the problem as they believe these spring washers will wear out and the problem will come back. So I've been thinking about it and as you may have seen in some of my other videos, I'm a real fan of these ceramic spindles. So when I was thinking about the anti-hammer problem, the problem actually exists because the seat of the tap starts to wear and the spindle wears, which allows the water to pulsate up and down in between the washer and the base of the seat when you're opening and closing those taps. So thinking about this, I thought, I wonder if there is ceramic spindles will solve the problem. Now I've had a bit of an experiment and I know it will, but you watch on and see the results for yourself. So as always, when doing anything plumbing, the first thing you need to do is to locate your water mains and to switch that off. Now, these are typically at the front of your house and this is what they look like. So having located the water mains, we simply turn the tap off. And there we go. So with the mains off, we just need to release the water out of the system. And as you can see, we've got that out there. Now we just need to take the top off of the tap, the locking uh, nut there. All right, so we've got that off. And then we just, as we did before, we just undo the base of the tap. And then we can get to the spindle. And then the, there you go, you can see right here, this is the springed washer, which we put in previously to stop the pipe hammer. And that's been really effective. But interestingly, it has been about six months. And what you can see, I'll just show you up close. You can see that, that actually has worn quite excessively that rubber. So I think people in the comments were correct that, you know, you're still going to be replacing these washers every probably year or so and looking at that wear and these are expensive washers relative to a normal standard washer as opposed to once we install these ceramic spindles these really are a, considered to be a lifetime fit and these will not wear out all right so to install these ceramic spindles it really is quite easy So you remove the plastic base cap. And one of the things to make sure is that you actually have these two pieces separated to start with. So with that plastic base cap installed, you then thread the main component down into the seat. Now the reason that you will not get any pipe hammer is the base of the ceramic spindle makes a 100% contact with the seat and never actually lifts up because the water actually flows up through the inside of the ceramic spindle and out through those ceramic discs. So therefore, with this installation, you will never get that pipe hammer effect. So having screwed that piece in by hand, we just need to tighten up that onto the base of the seat, just lightly. Just so it goes up firm. We don't need to over tighten this. So you can just see I've applied normal tap pressure there. And then we make sure we've got the seal on and then we screw down the cap over the top. Just like that. And then we firmly fasten this. So with that in place, we can now test. So we'll go switch the water back on. All right, so that water mains back on, we can now test. And 
And you can see we get 100% no pipe hammer effect with this ceramic spindle. So just check for leaks. And we can see there's no leaks around. That's just a little bit of surface water there. So we're good to go to completely assemble this tap. All right, so to assemble, we simply need to take that top off that I loosely fitted, put the base back on. Get the top on here. And put the locking nut on the top, on the cold. And we are done. Now, because I'm such a fan of these ceramic spindles, I don't need to, but I'm also gonna change the hot so they'll be the identical level and you know, then I just won't have to replace any tap washers in this bathroom, hopefully ever again in my lifetime. So I'll switch that water off and we'll get into it. So that's installed and the mains water's back on. So let's just test it. All right, so as you can see, we've got absolutely no pipe hammer. We've got both of our ceramic discs installed. So all we have to do is do the final assembly, put the cap back on. And we are good to go. So there you go, folks. That's how to solve pipe hammer in a really easy way with replacing your traditional tap spindles and washers with ceramic spindles. And as I've explained, this is a long-term solution. So folks, you don't need to spend several hundred dollars calling a plumber out. This is something you can really do yourself. You've actually got a couple of alternatives, which you can see in my videos to use a traditional washer, but the spring style, a little bit more expensive, or as I've shown you here today, you can replace with a ceramic spindle and you get all of the benefits of the ceramic spindles. They last pretty much forever and they're easy on arthritis. They will not drip and like I say, all of those benefits. So if you have liked this video, do feel free to like, share and subscribe. And in the meantime, why don't you have a good day?